Come on, young men. Wow. Okay, so hello everyone. My name is Sam Daniel and hey, I'm Sammy. 12 years old. It is by God's grace that I'm here today to tell my testimony and take baptism. I was brought up and raised in a Christian family. As my parents were praying people, I grew up with the fear of God. Before I was even born, when my mom was three months pregnant with me, one of the pastors in India prayed and told that there was a good boy like Samuel in my mother's womb. My father prayed too and named me as Sam Daniel. When I was three months old, I was dedicated to God in India by a famous prophet and evangelist named John Daniel, the son of N. Daniel, the founder of Layman's Evangelical Fellowship International. Wow. That's why my parents made me grow, grow up in my faith in God's work. As I grew up surrounded by praying people, I learned how to pray and saw God's miracle from an early age. Mm. The, first most miracle, the first most remarkable miracle that happened to me was way back when I was five. We had this thing called Olympiad exams at our school. My mom made me study very hard and had high hopes for me, especially in math. Each exam was a certain subject, it was held each week. After I wrote the math exam, it turned out I got many mistakes. My mom was very disappointed and she left me on my own for the other subjects. I prayed to God and studied very hard on my own and by God's grace, I got an international gold medal in English. Woo! Come on, like boy. This, I saw many more miracles in my life. Even though I was getting attracted to these worldly things and pleasures, God's fear and love would bring me back to his presence. I still remember when we were in Poland, I became very naughty and my teacher complained almost every day to my mom. <laughs> One morning, my mom strictly warned me that if she got any more complaints, she won't send me to school anymore. <laughs> but in the same evening, my teacher complained to my mom, so from the next day, I was not allowed to go to school. Wow. But by God's grace, from that day, the lockdown was implemented because of the COVID-19. And we had online classes. At the same time, we used to join vacation Bible classes for kids from our Indian church. By the teaching of our pastor's wife, Dr. Helen, I started to repent for my sins and ask forgiveness from my parents and sent an email to a teacher to whom I lied. After a few months, when we came to Belgium, I was praying to God for my salvation, and he gave me this verse. Psalm 108, 1. Oh God, my heart is fixed. I will sing and give praise, even with my glory. After a year, this verse finally got fulfilled, and now I'm playing the guitar in VB Kids Ministry. That's right. This... This year, I fixed my mind on taking baptism because I want to show the public that I am in Christ and I'm proud of it. Please pray for me that I may be faithful to, to God throughout my whole life until my last breath. Thank Come you. Come on. Yes. A big man. Come on. All the kids are here to support you, Sam. Come on. Thank God for COVID, huh? Samuel, you're the man, you're the man. So Samuel, because of your faith in the Lord Jesus Christ um, uh, and uh, your confession of him as your Lord and Savior, we have this incredible privilege to baptize you now in the name of the Father, the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Oh, happy day, happy day. Come on, you wash my sin away. Oh, happy day. Happy day, I'll never be the same. Oh, happy day, happy day, you wash my sin away. Oh, happy day, happy day, I'll never be the same.